Hello, Hornets. Hi, Hornets. Happy Monday. We are here. We are here with our friends, Holly the Hornet. And who do you have with you, Miss Gallo? Mr. G, Mr. Giraffe. Hi, Mr. G. Good morning. Good morning. And we are here on Stuffed Animal Day recording our announcement. So we hope that you had a great Dia de Peluche in your class. And here are the announcements for Monday, uh, February 22nd, 2021. Kiddos, we have still have so many Valentines left in the cafeteria. So make sure that you send your folks. Um, this is what it looked like last week. And it's a little bit better. I would say the kinder and first tables are almost cleared. But the second, third, and fourth, and fifth, you still have lots of treats to pick up. So, um, oh, this is wrong. So it's Monday, 8 to 10, and then 3.30 to 5.30. Okay, Mondays, every, every Monday we do distribution. And then Thursday, 8 to 11, they can come pick those up. Sí, todavía tenemos muchos valentines en la cafetería. Por favor, vengan a uh, los lunes de las 8 a las 10 de la mañana y otra vez de las 3 y media a las 5 y media en la tarde y los jueves de las 8 a las 11. Así es de que, por favor, vengan a la cafetería a recoger sus materiales. And just a reminder again, we're celebrating differences and we're also celebrating African American History Month this month. So the first piece is around students who are really practicing, including others, solving conflict, and really overall just being respectful kiddos and not only just accepting everybody's differences, but celebrating everybody's and really celebrating everybody's uniqueness. And then this is our last week of our African American History Month celebration. So hopefully you're checking out Miss um, Gilly's slides if you want to do a read aloud and learning a lot about that in class. Sí, todavía estamos um, celebrando las diferencias y esto significa que estamos buscando a los estudiantes que están uh, buscando amiguitos y compartiendo y celebrando cómo somos diferentes um, con nuestros compañeros y celebrando nuestras virtudes porque todos somos muy únicos y es importante celebrar esas diferencias que tenemos. También estamos todavía en el mes de febrero que estamos celebrando la historia de los afroamericanos, así es que aprovechamos de la biblioteca de H.A. High para leer libros y mirar las grandes cosas que han hecho nuestros compañeros afroamericanos en nuestra historia de aquí de los Estados Unidos. And we have um, an exciting event coming up on March 4th. We have an art night. So I've linked the flyer here. Um, we have um, at six o'clock, we'll have a virtual art night where parents can come pick up materials. We have some gel pens and some paper and all kinds of other goodies. Um, if you were, are interested in attending that event, you come to the cafeteria the first week of March to get your materials and then join us live on March 4th at 6 p.m. for those um, for that virtual art class. And that will also be during distribution on Monday and Thursday, right, to pick up those materials. Entonces, vamos a tener un día muy divertido de arte. Queremos invitarlos a todos ustedes si quieren participar, que pueden venir a la hora de distribución, lunes de las 8 a las 10 y de las 3 y media a las 5 y media o el jueves de las 8 a las 11 a recoger sus materiales de arte y después a las 6 de la tarde, el 4 de marzo, se ponen en línea y hacemos arte juntos. Vamos a tener pinturas, pinceles, papel, para que vengan a recogerlo y tener una noche muy divertida juntos uh, por medio del internet. And to prepare for art night, we want to start celebrating all that beautiful art that you are doing at home. So we're asking kids to bring in, send in their art with their parents um, when they come for distribution. And we're going to start uh, decorating the school with all of your art projects. If you don't have an art project, you can come pick up a coloring sheet. Um, thank you, Mr. Siegesman, for creating our uh super cute hornet here. And it says, even when we're far away, we are still hornets. We have this in English and Spanish. Parents can pick those up for you to color and bring that back. So we want to decorate with two things, the art you're doing in your classes with Miss Daria or your classroom teacher, or you can pick up your coloring sheet and bring it back. 
Uh -huh. Queremos decorar nuestra escuela. Um, queremos poner todo su arte en las paredes para que cuando vengan a recoger puedan mirar todo el arte que están haciendo con la maestra Miss Daria, Miss Moulton, o con sus maestros en la clase. Y si no tienen un proyecto de arte que quieren compartir, pueden venir a recoger la hoja que tiene Miss Hopkins y la pueden uh, colorear y traerla para atrás y la podemos poner en nuestra escuela. Just keeping you updated on what our Lexia data looks like. So we're still at about 28% kiddos. Remember, we want to get to about 60%. Uh, Ms. Gallo and I realized maybe it's because of these short weeks that it's gone down. So next week we have five full days. So remember to be using your Lexia as much as possible and as, as your teacher is asking you to. Uh -huh. During your asynchronous time. Entonces, mm -hmm. queremos recordarles que usen Lexia. Uh, todos los días, por favor, queremos hacer el intento para ir subiendo la marca de nuestro usaje en Lexia por lo menos 20 minutos a 30 minutos todos los días. Ahorita estamos a 28% y la meta es subirnos a 60%. And it looks like third grade. They are actually the highest. So congratulations, third grade. They are meeting 56% are meeting their usage minutes. So great job there. And then congratulations. To fifth grade, this is our iStation data. So fifth grade, I asked you guys to step it up and plug into iStation and you are. So we're seeing an increase here. Everybody else is about the same. So again, I know we've had some short weeks, uh, but congratulations fifth grade for getting that usage up. Let's see. Um, and lastly, we're going to go over our Hyde Pride slips. We had a lot of kids getting um, Hyde Pride slips this week, Miss Gallo. We had Cynthia, Escutia, Giselle, Maya twice, uh, Kevin Olivo, Mateo Ignacio, Mateo Estrada, Camila Gonzalez, Angel Ar Arispe, Matthew Vilgra Vilagran, um, Melanie Aguare, Bailey Barnum, Ravi Dworkin, Brandon Medrano, Azariah Aprego, Julian DeMello, Sofia Diaz, all from Mr. Diaz and Music, and then from these various teacher homerooms. Determination. Good job. Determination again. Lots of determination and high expectations. Good job, kiddos. Yeah, and from Miss Livingston's class, we have quite a few hornets. They're showing some determination as well. Andres, Jewel, Destiny, Nathaniel, Devaney, Julian, all showing determination. Again, Destiny, Kim, Denise, Delilah, Malana, Daniel, Jesus, Andres, Juan B, and Kaylee showing determination. And Adi Lene showing determination. Showing high expectations, we have Julian, good job. And showing integrity, we have Andres and Destiny. Felicidades. For Ms. Fernandez's class, we've got a slew of these guys. David, Violeta, William, Uneri, Daniela, Az Azalia, Jose, Aliana, Anisa, Peter, Alexander, Milo, a lot of familiar names here. Yaret, see? Oh, <laughs> keeps going, Brad. Yes. <laughs> and Bradley, Daniela, Jose, Alexander, Yaretzi, Milo, Bradley, Milo, Uneri, Azeli, Jose, Aliana, and Peter. Good job, Ms. Fernandez's class. Determination and high expectations. And from Misty Workin's class, we have a lot of students showing high expectations. Están mostrando expectativas muy altas en la clase de Misty Workin. Valentina, Natalie, Martin, Cristal, Noah, Mateo Estrada, Brittany, Andrea, Heidi, Heidi y Camila. And from Mr. Ide's class, showing integrity, we have Arleth, Athena, Jire, Kalina, and Alexander. Good job. Adriel, Emiliano, Aaron, Angelica, Christian, Damien, Gretchen. Good job, Gretchen, Kevin, Daniela, Xavier, Alia, Angelica, Dominic, Elizabeth, and Ava, all from Ms. Gallagher's class. High expectations, determination, respect. They've been doing such a good job. I got to visit their reading group yesterday. Awesome job, kiddos. Yeah, and again from Mr. Ide's class, we have students showing respect. We have Catherine, Alexander, Arleth, Rafael, Isaac, Lindsay, Yolanda, Emily, Jasmine, Joel, Lucy, Kalina, Andrew, Kayla, Alejandro, Danny, 
Le Leon, Joel Ruelas, Julian, Jeffrey, Adán, Sergio, Gabriel, Adán, Juliana. Good job, guys. Great job, Mr. Ice Class, showing respect. And for Mrs. Barça, we have uh, Liam, Emily, Daniela, Ispeidi, Diego, Casey, Daphne, Isabella, Brenda, Andrea, Victoria, Samantha, Nevea, Abigail, Galilea, and Sebastian, all showing respect, high expectations, determination, and integrity. Awesome job, Hornets. Let's give them Ooh. all. Have a really great learning, you guys. We're signing off. Have a wonderful week of learning.